Hello there and welcome to the new Power BI tutorial video and in this tutorial video I will show you the median and median x function. It basically uh, you know both these different functions have a different usage and I want to show you in this video if you are wondering or if you have a particular scenario where you if you want to use just the median on a given field or if you want to use an expression and then want to take a median or the middle value of that then you can use the median x in those scenarios all right and before i move ahead just a quick information that in the description you can find the three different links a, a link for all the power specify power bi specific videos a link for all the videos of my channel and uh, a link for the uh, data set that i'm using it over here and not just this you can find many other data sets for doing the uh for doing the practice all right so before further discussion uh let's just go ahead and do the median so in the previous video we have looked at the average and now what i'll do is i will just come here on this orders table and i will going to create a new measure which will be a median so we will call it a median underscore sales and we will say median and we will specify the sales and that should be it right so what it will going to give us it will basically in the back end do all this calculation where it sorts the value in the ascending order and whatever is the middle value it gives us that so if your data set is having or your field is having the extreme value then those will be ignored which is not the case when it comes to the average okay so what i'll do is i'll just select this and add this over here and close it all right so now if you see the median value for for sales for all of this is basically coming as 470 which probably does not look right to me because it should be different for different categories so let's just quickly evaluate if we have messed up something without uh giving a lot of focus so median sales okay consumer data right that's not what we want and that's why we were so it's only giving the uh, median for consumer data and that's why we were getting this so we just need to make sure that i choose order sales press enter and that should be it and now you should get the different value for different fields so now if you see the main thing which i want to show you is average of sales and median of sales if you see the median of sale is half of average of sales so what does it impact it says that average is being influenced or average of sales or the average function is being influenced from the high end value whereas the median sales basically said that's exactly the median point is so this is a matter of discussion but if you see for example in copier and facts 12992 is very close to 12028 so it's, it's not an issue right but scenario like this one 1698 706 1051 to 624 all of these are a matter of concern and that's the thing we need to basically resolve when it comes to choosing what whether we should take median or we should take average all right now let's go to the uh, the median x function so median x function like gross average sales if you see the gross average sales is basically an average of an expression it's a simple expression and it can be as complex as, as you want but the idea is that you take a median of that expression all right so what we will going to do is we will just make sure that this table is selected click on new measure and here we will say median x underscore sales and we will use the median x function specify the table which is order and now we will say sales again order sales make sure that whatever you are entering if the same field is there like we did the last time then it will not give you the expected output um, then you have profit close this should be done and now we have median sales here let's just add this oops not here but into this table so make sure the table is selected then add median x sales and if you see the gross average sales is 1922 
median sale is 683 so huge difference same is the case over here little bit of difference here as well so what to choose what not to choose is is a matter of concern and even in this case total the total is coming for gross average sales the which which is a median sorry which is the average is 1956 but in case of 401 so what is right is a matter of debate when you grill data a little bit more talk to the smes you will find more about it but what i wanted to show you is the functioning of both median and median x function so that you can utilize it whenever the situation is arising without much of a problem so that's pretty much it i wanted to talk about and now i'll meet you in the next video with a new topic